Hi, I'm here with Allison Hinton, host and producer and award-winning yes. of the award-winning show Money Talks on WMPG's radio. Welcome, Allison. Thank you. And yes, that's what I tell people my new name, Allison, or award-winning Allison award -winning of Money Allison. Talks. That's right. Congratulations. Thank you. The show Money Talks, being on the air for only four months at yes. the time, was chosen to submit uh, one of their shows. Mm -hmm for the National uh, Association of Broadcasting Awards, and they actually won the award, and it was a last minute chance. Yes. Uh, tell us about how it all kind of happened. I'd only been on the air for four months. We did this great show on foreclosures, ironically. That's yeah. the happy topic <laughs> happy, of four happy. Of foreclosures. <laughs> And the main association of broadcasters calls out for award submissions every year, and I submitted it. It was a last minute chance to do it, and a couple months later, I got a call. Screamed, took out somebody's ear for a couple days, I'm sure. But yeah, we won. <laughs> That's fantastic. Congratulations. Thanks. Uh, it's so funny that the show was the foreclosure show because, as we were talking earlier, and Money Talks is kind of a really casual. Yes, we are a very casual, casual show on on money. It's not one of those high finance, you know. Yeah, I'm very high finance. Yeah. <laughs> you can tell, can't you? No, it's very low key. Yes, tell us, what's the theme of the, the show? The theme, yes, the theme is that people would rather talk about their sex lives than their money mm -hmm. and their financial issues. It's so, so true. <laughs> I know, so let's talk about money and do it in a really low key, fun way. Uh, the producer, I'm sorry, the engineer of our show, Michael Manning, won with me. and great. He's great, yeah, both of us won the award. And we banner back and forth. He'll pop in with thoughts. It's a, it's a really just low-key, fun way to talk about money. Great. So tell me a little bit about some of the topics that you've had on the show in the past. You know, we've got the foreclosure, which I'm sure was probably a more serious show, but... Uh, we've done everything from how to hold a successful garage sale yeah. and when it's getting to be ready for garage sale season to our most serious topic was how to live financially when you're disabled. Yeah. We've done a couple of shows on credit scores when I got designated as a credit, I think it was dweeb, geek, credit dweeb. Credit dweeb. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm a credit dweeb now. Um, <laughs> we're going to do a show on weatherization, anything to help people yeah. save money, talk about money, get rid of some of the myths about money. So it's kind of like a no holds bar. I mean, the whole idea is people would rather talk about sex. And when you think about, let's talk about sex, you know, it's kind of like, no, let's really talk about it. What's on your mind? Same thing with money. Yeah. You know, yeah. just the everyday living of how you live with money, how you live without money. <laughs> yeah, uh, people deal with money every day, but I mean, were you taught to deal with money? No. Most no. people weren't. Yeah. Uh, and, and a lot of the things that you read about money say, oh, you should do this or you shouldn't do that or bad, bad, bad for doing that. I always say, let's, you know, you can use money for good or evil, please, let's use it for good. Yeah. But if you choose to use it for evil, okay, just know what you're doing. Right. Take the um, consequences that go with yeah, it. Yeah. And people just don't like to talk about money. Yeah. And so who have been some of the guests and what do you get people from organizations that, like local organizations to come and speak or is it I've kind had, of a call in? It's uh, everything from local organizations. I had somebody calling in from California to talk nice. about kids and money. Great. Um, it's. I, I get lots of suggestions actually on what topics to have from friends, people listening will say, hey, have you ever thought about doing a show? And then I go out and find Great. who to interview. And so do people call into your show? Oh, yeah. Wonderful. Oh, yes. Oh, that's great. So have you had a few surprises or? Um, I think the biggest surprise was a show where I went on air and said, okay, I'm going to admit it, I have no debt, I have no mortgage, no <laughs> debt, call me and tell me whether you think I'm an idiot or whether you think that's the greatest thing you've ever heard of. Wow. And people called in and said, that's great, but as one of my friends said, if you'd done the show two years ago, probably half the people would have said you were an idiot, but you wow. know, let's talk about right. whether your decisions are good or bad and why. Let's talk about the why behind the decision rather than they told me. Or even just get, or hearing, when other people speak about their problems, it gives other people options and ideas that they may not have thought of before. Yeah, yeah, let's and, talk. I mean, yeah. yeah, I've gotten lots of ideas from the show. I mean, I research the show, and I still get lots of great ideas from people. Oh, great. It's a fabulous show. I have caught it a few times, oh, good. and I'm definitely going to catch it in. <laughs> now I know exactly when to tune in. You've got to hear this show. It's Money Talks with Allison Hinton and your engineer. Is Michael Manning. Michael Manning. Tune in Wednesday nights at 8 p.m. 
on WMPG. You yes. can get that at 90.9, 104.1, or you can stream it, watch it on the, on the uh, listen to it on the I web. I know, they haven't <laughs> given us a webcam yet. <laughs> you need one. Uh, on www.wmpg.org. Congratulations. Thank you. This is fabulous. I hope the show continues on, and I, I hope, hope you so win too. more awards. I do, too. It's fun. <laughs> I like it. Thank you so much for sharing Thank with us. Thank you. Back to you, Tom.